As someone who loves finding natural solutions to everyday problems, I've discovered that vinegar is one of the best ingredients for making a homemade pest control spray. It's incredibly effective at repelling a variety of pests, from ants and mosquitoes to fruit flies and spiders. Plus, creating a vinegar mix is simple and safe for humans and pets. Let me walk you through how I use vinegar to keep my home pest free and which pests it works best on. 1. Fruit Flies Getting rid of fruit flies with white vinegar is both straightforward and effective. Here's how I do it, step by step guide. Pour about half a cup of white vinegar into a small bowl or cup. If you have apple cider vinegar, that works great too since fruit flies are particularly attracted to it. Add a few drops of dish soap to the vinegar. This breaks the surface tension, causing the fruit flies to sink and drown once they land on the surface. Place the bowl or cup where you often see fruit flies, such as near fruit bowls, trash cans, or sinks. For an extra measure, cover the bowl with plastic wrap, secure it with a rubber band, and poke a few small holes in the plastic. This lets the flies in but makes it hard for them to escape. Leave the trap out for a day or two, and you should start seeing fruit flies accumulating in the solution. Once the trap has collected a significant number of fruit flies, dispose of the contents, clean the bowl, and refill it with fresh vinegar and dish soap if needed. Repeat this process until you no longer see fruit flies. 2. Ants Using white vinegar to get rid of ants is simple and highly effective. Here's my method, step-by-step -step guide. Mix equal parts of white vinegar and water in a spray bottle E. G, one cup of each. Identify the areas where ants are frequently seen. Follow their trails to find entry points or nests. Spray the vinegar solution directly onto the ants and along their trails. Pay special attention to entry points like windowsills, doorways, and cracks. Use a cloth or sponge to wipe the sprayed areas. This helps remove the pheromone trails that ants use to communicate and navigate. Spray the solution in areas where ants have been seen, such as countertops, cabinets, and floors. Wipe these areas thoroughly to deter ants from returning. Reapply the vinegar solution daily or as needed until the ants are gone. Consistency is key to ensuring they don't return. 3. Gnats Gnats are some of the most irritating household pests, but I've found an effective solution using a mixture of dish soap, water, baking soda, and vinegar. Step-by-step -step guide Mix a few drops of dish soap a tablespoon of vinegar, and baking soda per cup of water in a spray bottle. Spray this mixture in areas where gnats are commonly seen, such as around plants and in bathrooms. Number 4. Spiders. White vinegar is a natural and effective method to get rid of spiders. Here's how I do it, step-by-step -step guide. Mix equal parts of white vinegar and water in a spray bottle. Determine the areas where spiders are frequently seen or might be entering your home, such as corners, windowsills, doorways, and basements. Spray the vinegar solution directly onto spiders when you see them. This kills them on contact. Pay special attention to cracks and crevices where spiders might be hiding. Use a cloth or sponge to wipe down the sprayed areas. Repeat the spraying process daily or as needed until you no longer see spiders. Number 5. Mosquitoes. Mosquitoes hate the smell of vinegar. Here's how I use vinegar to repel them, step-by-step -step guide. Mix equal parts of white vinegar and water in a spray bottle and add a few drops of dish soap to help it stick to surfaces better. Determine the areas where mosquitoes are frequently seen or might be breeding, such as near standing water, patios, and doorways. Spray the vinegar solution around these areas, on outdoor furniture, around doorways, 
and windowsills to deter mosquitoes from entering your home. You can also spray the solution on your skin and clothing as a natural repellent. However, avoid spraying near your eyes or any open wounds. Number 6. Cockroaches. White vinegar is extremely effective in repelling cockroaches. Here's how I use it, step-by-step -step guide. Mix equal parts of white vinegar and water in a spray bottle, then add a few drops of dish soap to the mixture. Dish soap helps break down grease and residues that attract cockroaches. For added repellent power, include a few drops of essential oils like peppermint or eucalyptus, which cockroaches dislike. Use the vinegar solution to clean kitchen counters, floors, and other surfaces where food particles and residues may be present. Spray the vinegar solution directly into areas where cockroaches are commonly seen or suspected to hide, focusing on cracks, crevices, under sinks, behind appliances, and other dark, damp places. The strong odor of vinegar will naturally deter cockroaches. Number 7. Bed bugs. Using white vinegar to help repel and kill bed bugs is a natural, non-toxic method. Here's how I do it, step-by-step -step guide. Inspect your mattress, box spring, bed frame, and nearby furniture for signs of bed bugs, such as live bugs, eggs, and dark spots. Pour undiluted white vinegar into a spray bottle. Use it straight from the bottle without mixing it with water for maximum effectiveness. Generously spray the vinegar directly onto bed bugs when you see them. Vinegar can kill bed bugs on contact by disrupting their nervous system. Spray all areas where bed bugs are likely to hide, including mattress seams, tufts, folds, bed frame, headboard, and any nearby furniture. Be thorough and ensure the vinegar penetrates into cracks, crevices, and seams. Remove all bedding, linens, and clothing from the infested area and wash them in hot water. Dry them on the highest heat setting for at least 30 minutes to kill bed bugs and their eggs. Store cleaned items in plastic bags or airtight containers to prevent reinfestation. Repeat the spraying process daily or as needed until you no longer see signs of bed bugs. Consistency is key to controlling an infestation. Number 8. Moths. Vinegar is a fantastic natural moth repellent. Here's how I use it, step-by-step -step guide. Wipe down furniture, drawers, cabinets, walls, and other hard surfaces with a solution of one part white vinegar to two parts water. The strong acidic smell will repel moths and cleanse the area from dirt, dust, moth eggs, and larvae. For fabrics, spray a vinegar and water solution on most fabrics after doing a spot test to ensure that fabric dyes will not be affected. White vinegar will also kill carpet moths through an acidic cleansing process. Apply vinegar using a sponge, rag, or spray bottle. Number 9. Stink Bugs. A homemade spray containing dish soap and white vinegar can kill stink bugs on the spot. Here's how I do it, step-by-step -step guide. Fill a spray bottle with two cups of hot water, one cup of white vinegar, and half a cup of dish soap. Spray it directly on the stink bugs to kill them on contact and neutralize their odor. Spray the vinegar solution around windowsills, doorways, and any other potential entry points. The strong smell of vinegar can help deter stink bugs from entering. One final tip, pairing vinegar with essential oils such as tea tree oil, lemon oil, or orange oil can increase its effectiveness. It's worth experimenting with essential oils on any of the pests we've discussed. If you found this pest control tutorial helpful, please subscribe to Animal Sounds Around Us, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on how to effectively get rid of pests with baking soda. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.